Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. If you guys saw the last video, you guys know that Dust and I, we sent it out west to do some fishing in my new boat, and this is day two. Day one was epic, but we're waking up. It's about 7.40 in the morning. We're gonna putz on over to the lake and do some fishing the rest of the day and then go home. I don't know what today's video's agenda is gonna be, but we're, we're just gonna fish, so. We're starting the video off at the Airbnb. Wanted to show you that real quick. Oh yeah, not bad. Not bad at all for just two of us. That was my room that Dustin was just in. This is Dustin's room. Bathroom. And then here's the best part. You just open this up and... Oh! What up, Tundra Man? Oh yeah, just fooling downtown with the Tundra. All right, that's enough talking. Dustin, you ready to go catch some walleyes? Yeah. Maybe some big ones today, hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Lots of numbers yesterday, so. Lots of numbers, hoping for a big today. Oh yeah, we have made it to the lakes, ladies and gentlemen. Cheers. Ah, dude, low key might be my favorite new flavor. Sour Pink Lemonade, pretty goaded by Ghost. Sponsor me, phase out. All right, well, we're gonna start fishing here. There's a little bit of rippleage going on, but yesterday we came out to this basically like four to six foot weed flat and we we're just sight fishing these walleyes. And we're probably gonna do the same today and try a couple other new places as well. Gonna start out with a jig head and a swim bait paired to my 7.3 St. Croix rod. And uh, I got that Carbon X on there as well, you already know. But we're gonna start trolling around. Dang, that one ate it. I saw that one eat it like that. That was kind of lit. Hey, fish number one of the day. A little male. Oh, not the ghost. Not the ghost. Okay, we're good. We're good. A ghost and a walleye. I was getting bit every cast, and finally I hooked up with one. We will keep fish probably later today because Dustin and I are absolute savages. But we were saying, you know, we need something to look forward to later. So we're just gonna like give them the free pass right now, right, Dustin? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But cheers, first fish. Oh god. Hey, why am I getting bit actually actually every cast? Oh, this sucks. Oh, this one's a fighter. Oh, not gonna lie, it's 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 hurting me because I know this is gonna be a perfect eater. This is the very next cast after that uh, that my first one I just caught. Gosh, dang, they are feisty this morning, bro. Look at that, like, dude, I would eat the heck out of that man. Hmm. Mm mm mm. Should we just start the harvest now? I'd hate it if we did that. I need to get a little head start anyways. You're a better fisherman than me. Yeah, man, you go ahead and start. Hey, that's like a perfect eater. Already unhooked himself. <sighs> Dude, I know I literally just said like one second ago, we're not gonna be keeping fish at the moment, but I think that's changing. We're just gonna we're just gonna start filling that box up because this is too perfect of an eater. Shoo! That's going in the box. Okay, we harvesting. We are harvesting in the new boat. I love it.
Ooh, that one crushed it. So right now we're not even sight fishing. We're just basically sitting on the edge of a weed flat and we're just casting plastics and just doing a slow retrieve and getting hammered in the process. I caught one nice female yesterday. She already dumped her eggs, unfortunately, even though the, the ice just came off yesterday as well. But we're hoping to maybe catch at least a couple big females today. I mean, it's gonna be a lot of these pesky males, but that's fine. And there's like two fall in it. That's so cool. Like if I had another rod, I could just flip in right there. Look at that. Look at, oh, the other wall, I just went back down. So cool. So cool. Just hammering, absolute hammering the plastics. If you guys are not out fishing right now for walleyes, what are you doing? This is the time to be doing it. Well, most of you guys are probably closed because Wisconsin and Minnesota are closed, but in the Dakotas, it's open season, baby. Damn it, that was my brand new big head. Crank, dude. Oh my gosh, dude, it's every cast. This is so much fun. We're having fun. Oh, this one's fighting. This one is fighting. He maybe has some weeds on him. Maybe it's a female. Maybe it is a female. No, it's just, I think it's just another pesky, fesky me male. I can't even talk right now. Oh, there's like, how many other are falling right now? One. Look at them. Look at them, there's three. There's three falling. Look at the surface. There's, wh wh why? What the heck, that's so weird, bro. The, the walleyes just follow each other. They come up to the surface. They're just checking out what their homie's doing. Oh my gosh, guys. Buddy Dustin. Hey, guys. How's retying? Oh, dude. Kind of fun harvesting. Hey, like yeah, I've just been casting, casting every, like just fan cast and catching them every cast still. So I'm like, well, Meinzel. Meinzel. I didn't catch one that cast. Let's move. But I did. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this is insane, bro. Oh shoot, uh, I let one go. I don't even know what my, yeah, what is my count at? So I have three in the box right now? Yeah, three in the box, so four, five. I'm at five right now. Five fish of the day so far, I've been fishing for like 10 minutes. Not even. Golly. Golly. This one's fun. Oh gosh. That's so fun. It, it's literally, I've never really watched walleyes interact like this before. Pretty cool. Pretty cool stuff. <sighs> Look at that. Another gorgeous walleye. Sight fish that one. Can't complain. What do you have? You're like, oh god. Oh. Oh. oh, that was so sick. Gosh. Sight fishing these fish. So much fun. So much fun. This one's actually oh oh me and Dustin are doubled up. Let me bring my fish around here. Should we just let him 
they just let them swim right here for a second? Like, you think they're going to have more buddies show up? Oh, we're good. Oh, well, me and Dustin are doubled up and we're waiting to see if the Calvary's gonna come over and check out what's going on. <laughs> we got decoys. We got decoys? Dang. This red. Look at that. That is so cool. That sucks. Were you not looking at that one? No, I was. Oh, you were? Yeah. Dang, we're trying to get some underwater eats right now while catching some of these whale eyes. Dustin's got his bait camera out. Oh, it's a little far out, huh? Come over. Look at it. Here's, here comes. Here comes like four. Another one bites the dust. Four. <laughs> oh my god, just freaking annihilated that thing, dude. Oh, that one just hammered that dude. <laughs> there we go. Another one. Okay. Yeah, Dustin and I are just messing around now, getting some underwater shots. Maybe he'll get send me some of the footy. Hey, I like this gravel. You could probably throw whatever. Oh, missed one. Oh, missed another one. Oh, missing. There he is. Oh, God. Well, we switched spots. And <laughs> there's so many. We switched spots to an old gravel bed. Oh, see the road right there, Dustin? Yeah. Yeah, we switched spots to this old gravel bed. And first cast, I got one. I hit like probably three others. So there is a lot of walleyes back here. Can confirm. It's not weeds, so this is going to be different. We're going to be fishing something other than weeds for once, which is going to be kind of nice. Come on. Hey. We on them still. The ones back, there's a lot more back here, but these ones are 10 times more spookish. So we don't like that. Well, we're gonna take a little midday lunch break. Dustin and I actually grabbed some sandwiches the other day. Freaking hungry, man. Catch all these fish. Really takes a toll on you. We got, uh, let's see here. Extra large roast beef Italiano sub. Looks pretty good. It, for a gas station sandwich? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Well, here you go, boys. Cheers.
That's pretty solid. They did load it down with meat. Oh yeah, there's meat. So I'm like, lettuce might be nice on this, but. It is just meat and cheese, but. That's pretty solid though. Uh -huh. We're gonna eat the rest of this and then putz around, maybe go back to spot number one and catch some more fish. Come here. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, then there's three with them on top of the water. Why is there three with them on top of the water like that? Hmm. Interesting. Like, that is, that's crazy. Look at that. Look at that. His buddy is just like chilling right there. We got walleyes on, walleyes, following walleyes. We got doubles over here. Same thing with Dustin. He's got 10 walleyes next to him too. This is just, oh, this is just a terrible day. This is just an awful, terrible day. That's a nice one. That is a nice one. What the heck? Well, Dustin and I made a move back to OG spot. And yeah, it's just still stupid loaded. But I think we're gonna call that. I mean, you guys have seen Dustin and I catch countless amounts of walleye, sight fishing, doing pretty much whatever. Just, just there's, there's just walleyes being caught in this video. And uh, you guys are probably bored of this. So we're actually going to pack up and trailer the boat, drive home and cook these some of these up for dinner and enjoy our nice harvest. But wow, I mean, it doesn't get any better than this, man. It's not even May yet. It's April, the mid-April and the spawn is on. The next, oh, the next morning. baby check it out we got walleyes and waffles it's kind of hard to tell because it all blends in but this right there is our walleye and then we got our waffle with some syrup on it oh my gosh this looks pretty good well guys it's the next morning and i decided i have to make this walleye why not make some waffles with it I thought it was a good idea because you see fried chicken and waffles being served together a lot. I thought, I think walleyes and waffles would be pretty cool. So that's what I did. I just made a quick and easy, simple thing, threw it in the fryer, fried up the walleye, uh, busted out the waffle maker, made a waffle, and then put some syrup on top. And now we're gonna go for a bite. I'm pretty excited. All right, time to see if walleye and waffles is a good idea or not with some maple syrup. Yo. Oh.
Oh my gosh. That is certified bussin. Oh, that might be my new favorite way to eat walleyes. Holy cow. The little hint of maple syrup. Oh, that is so good. You guys need to try that. Make a waffle, fry up some walleyes, put the walleyes on top of the waffle, and just drench it in some syrup. You won't be pissed. That is surprisingly so good. I've never actually even had chicken and waffles. I just know it's a thing. That was amazing. But that is gonna wrap up today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Dustin and I had an awesome two day send out west in North Dakota, doing some fishing, some sight fishing to be exact. And the stars align, man. There's not very many days in the world where the Dakotas have no wind and it's sunny out. That is pretty rare. So uh, the fact that it happened and the spawn was going on at the same time, the stars aligned. I mean, it was meant to be. Sight fishing walleyes, it's a first for me. Had a lot of fun. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if you guys enjoyed that footage. And uh, maybe I'll try to get on another bite like that, but no promises because a lot of things need to align in order for that type of bite to happen. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video and we'll catch you guys on the next one.